All right, welcome back and thank you very much. It's CV3 New Day, 27th of December. We're wrapping up the year nice and easy. Four days to go. And tell you what, on the 6th of January, the president will release the ambulances. That's 10 days away from now. But we've got a nurse and a musician in studio, Katie Bakes, the pride of Sagakope and Ho and, and all of it. Katie, welcome. How are you doing? Good, Good to see you. Good Merry see Christmas. You. Merry Christmas. Where have you been hiding? I've been around. I've been around. <laughs> I've been so, around. so far, so good for you. Yeah. After carrying me away, we took everybody away. You won a few awards in South Africa and the rest of it. Yeah. What's the next step? What's happening next? And actually, this year I've been a little bit silent. Okay. Uh, Why? I've been in the studio. I've been working on a couple of albums because okay. I'm planning to drop uh, three albums. Uh, probably next year okay three albums three albums so in one year yeah in why, one why year. would you want to do that uh, well it was a managerial decision that they, they wanted me to come up with an album uh, because uh, when uh, you're looking at um, an artist's profile you would like to see how much work he has done out there and um, and so they felt like I have to come out with uh, okay. lots of work mm. Uh, I dropped a few singles uh, this year, but uh, they were not actually major productions. They, okay. they were not major works. Okay. I was on a few collaborations mm. also, uh, but the major work is, is going to be in next year. I see. Interesting. And are we looking at any big collaborations? The last time you were here, we were talking about collaborations. Yes. And um, is it happening in the album? Okay, I have I have uh, big collaborations, but okay. it's not on the first uh, album I'm dropping. Okay. Cause, uh, okay. That first album is uh, it's only me. I'm the only just artist. just you yes. doing your thing. Yes. Okay. Yes. So where so do we see the collaborations coming? In the second, in? second, in the second album. The second okay, and the third album possibly. Yeah, see. Third. So this album, how many songs are we putting on it? I have uh, eight songs on it. Eight. Eight songs on wow. the first album. Lovely. Yeah. And it's taking you a year to put it together. Not actually a, a year uh, per se, uh, but I've been involved with other things also, you know, okay. it's, apart from the music, I, I have a job yes, also, course, I do yeah. so. I've you save lives. With, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can say that again. I've been caught up within these two things and so that's how it has been. If you look at the songs or you listen to the songs on the album, yeah, uh, will it be sweeter than uh, what we've seen, Carry Me Away, or will Carry Me Away still be rainy? Oh, of course, of course, yeah, they are better than Carry Me Away. If, if uh, let's say, if if they are not nicer than Carry Me Away, then it means I'm not making progress. But uh, in my scope of work, uh, what I've, what I've uh, uh, given myself, the target I've given myself is to make sure that each and every new song that mm. I compose okay. should be much better than the previous ones. So. Definitely, I'm sure you're going to have more than three favorites on that album. Okay. Who is Julia? <laughs> <laughs> Who is Julia? Uh, <clears throat> uh, Julia is uh, an, Im an imaginary... Hey, master, master, slow down. Julia is an imaginary... Slow down, slow down. This is not imaginary. Who is Julia? Okay, Profession it, it was, it was... That song, I wrote that song out of... Uh, a real life experience. Okay. Uh, Julia uh, was a girl I was so much in love with, okay. and then uh, uh, we happened to be together. But due to uh, the problem of distance, we were in uh, two worlds apart. We we're in okay. uh, different. We we're living in different time zones. Okay. And so, for some reason, she had to move on without mm. me. And mm. even though we're so much attached, uh, she just had to leave me for someone else. So, okay. someone richer? Uh, yeah, like I said in the song, if you listen to the lyrics of what I say, mm. somebody richer, somebody nicer, you know. Okay. This thick and tall with melanin so fine. <laughs> <laughs> so, let's enjoy Julia, <laughs> the love of my life. Stray line. Whoa, why can't he make so? Yeah, yeah. I hate, I hate, I hate, I hate, I hate, I hate, I hate. Sorry about that. I will bring you that video a bit of a challenge there. But tell me, between. Money 
love and sex, which makes a relationship stand? Money, love, sex. Money. Money. Yeah, money. Central. Yeah. Sex is not important. Not exactly. Love is not. Not exactly. Why? Explain. Uh, because uh, in, in our present generation, money controls everything. Money rules everything. It doesn't matter how much you love. Money is, is central now. Wow. Yes, you can, you can have all the love. They, like they go ask you, it be sex, we go chop. Yeah. It be love, we go chop. No be six pack, we go chop. No money, we go chop. Yeah, so. <laughs> so it's money. Yeah, it's all about money now. And, and people don't care how, how, how money is made. No, why, why, do you think, why do you think, for instance, uh, I, I am not trying to uh, create this, uh, some kind of a stereotype. Okay. Uh, why do you think uh, a 23 year old girl can marry a man as old as 46 or 56? It's love. You think so? Is it not? <laughs> no way. It's money. It's money. Okay. It's money. You, you can have love. You can be so sweet. You can be so handsome. You can be so caring. But if you don't have money, she's going to leave you for someone else. <laughs> it's the reality. You have to accept it. Somebody might be out there and be thinking, okay, this guy is just blowing some BS or he's, a, he's, he doesn't know what he's saying. But that's the fact. Councilor Lutra says, don't marry a poor man. Good. Is, it, is he right? He's right. So what should happen to the poor man? They can't find love? No. No. I don't think anybody is created to be poor. I think God has given each and every one uh, uh, the same opportunity. Everybody but is born blessed. But there are people who just don't have it. I mean, they don't have it. Shouldn't they be able to find love? They should find love. But when you guys say it's money, counselor says, don't marry a poor man. You say the focus is money. I mean, money is money. most paramount. What should a poor man do? Uh, okay, then the poor man just have to work hard and pray, and pray more to God to, to get that money. Okay. Because, be, because he needs the money to make his life better as well. You know, mm. apart from the love, he needs money to make his life better. Mm. Anyway, New Year resolutions, let's talk about them quickly and then we'll wrap up. <clears throat> That's what we're doing here. Okay. Uh, New Year resolutions, what are they for you? Uh, the only New Year resolution I have is the one I've had last year. It's just to keep working harder. Uh, stay true to myself and to the people around me. Create good music. Uh, support the people around me, take good care of my patients and the most of all of them is to make sure that I stay true to my God. Mm. Are you going to be beefing anybody in 2020? No, no, no. no. You don't I like don't, beef? I don't like beef. You're a vegetarian. <laughs> <laughs> Katie Bates, always a pleasure to be hanging out with you. Let